Just got the latest in. We have a strong hurricane, 160 mile per hour winds. That actually came down just a little bit. Pressure is up just a little bit, but it's still very strong. It has picked up speed. It's moving to the northeast at 12 miles per hour, and it's now 405 miles to the southwest of Tampa. So if I get out of the way here, you can see Cancun, Cozumel down there, and there is the center. Decent looking eye here, and it's moving to the north and the east. Models now saying somewhere in here towards Sarasota, Siesta Key area. That may change just a little bit. No big changes in the watches and warnings. We still have a hurricane warning. The one change is it looks like it will be a little bit stronger as it makes landfall, 130 mile per hour winds versus 125. Late Wednesday night into Thursday morning, two in the morning, one, two in the morning. That's cat four guys right here along the coast. So that is only five miles difference, but that is still a category four hurricane. It's cat one all the way across the state. And then it actually will move off to the east and head just south of Bermuda. It looks like tropical storm watches all the way up the coastline right now up towards Wilmington. So here's where it's been kind of we, we had a big wobble earlier tonight and that shifted everything to the right, which meant it went from say the mouth of Tampa Bay down to Sarasota. And now it's pretty much on that track that the hurricane center has cold front is now just about here. It won't get much further south. We would love for this to come further south because then that would push this a little bit further away from the Tampa area. Don't think that's going to happen. Starting to see some really good thunderstorms out here producing water spouts. That's our tornado threat, and that will get in here early tomorrow morning. The forecast models. So they were up here near Tampa, obviously in this range right now for the most part. A couple still a little bit further to the south. I don't think we're going to see a whole lot more movement out of this. We could see perhaps just a little bit more to the south, but I just don't think we're going to see a whole lot. They've got the center coming in right over top. It looks like Siesta Key now late Wednesday night and Thursday. This is our forecast model. It's a little bit early. It's a little bit ahead of time. So four o'clock tomorrow. In fact, even mid morning, we've got showers and storms. But as we get past sunset, the winds really start to pick up on Wednesday evening. Center is right on our models right around nine o'clock and it's higher, but they're thinking around midnight on Thursday. So tropical storm force winds get in here around four or five o'clock tomorrow afternoon. So finish up those preps. We will talk more about what the wind levels will be and the areas to watch. And we're going to talk about surge. There have been some changes in the surge totals and I'll have those for you coming up.